click skills at a main you mercenaries. Are you struggling in special operations and always wondering why the others always get the hero and the full weapon set before time runs out? Are you always short of unstabilized weight and ask yourself how to get the most possible and how to use them most efficiently? Then you're perfectly the right person to watch this specific video, cause I'm gonna tell you how to play any special operation the most efficient way and how to get everything you wish for. Well, at least in this wonderful game. But first things first, what do we want? The hero and the full weapon set. And what do we have to do to achieve that? First, we have to understand how the special operations work and what sacrifices they demand. Unlike normal missions, you have to have unstabilized weight to play missions and deploy heroes. You get them from gifts, your rallies, daily roulettes and mission deploys. Also, they drop like other usable items in fights. But beware, here comes the first mistake to make. Make sure you first start the spec ops by using a mission. Otherwise, your previously accepted gifts are uncounted and you just lost 50 gifts and therefore 50 unstabilized weight. Same with Alice. Just wait until you started the spec ops. Main. Now, if you have started the special operation, you will see tasks. In order to get the hero, you have to accomplish all tasks in the given order. While there are several easy ones, like fighting or winning a few PvP battles, there come others you may can't finish if you have the right requirements. So, those tasks are collecting distress calls and unstable ISO 8. Please wait with collecting them until you get the task to do so. Second, boss and epic boss fights. So, if you are currently doing, for example, a research, wait until it's finished and you get the task to fight a specific boss or epic boss. Only then fight it, otherwise you have to play the whole mission again and with that you probably waste those rare unstable ISO 8. Third, collect deploys, same here. Wait until you get the task to do so, or you could come to the situation to play the mission a second time. By the way, many tasks can be completed outside of the special operations, just give it a try. Fourth, achieve a specific mission score. Most common here is first to achieve 3 and then 4 stars on all special operation missions. In order to get the highest mission scores, the most efficient way, you have to do as much deploys as you can and get the highest possible fight scores. To do that, you may want to inform yourself on how to get bonus points. Some important things to consider are team up bonuses, epic kills, number of critical hits and the number of items you use in a fight. The more, the better. Also, you don't want any of your heroes to die in combat and to have them fully healed at the end of a fight for some extra points. Currently, you get the highest team-up bonus with Anti-Venom and Hybrid for 400 points. But there are several other hype bonus teams like Hawkeye and Mockingbird. But just have a look at the list by clicking on the link in the video description. Now, how to get the hero? Well, you usually need to fight the epic boss in the last task, and to do so, you need to be able to make the required deploys. So you either want to spare up to 400 command points to buy the specific heroes when the time has come, or you spare 30 gold to finish the last task. Mostly, the needed heroes consist of one of the last PvP reward heroes in their given order, and the latest 90 CP hero you could have bought without any other requirements. The third hero is based on Playdom's random choice, so you may be lucky. If you are unsure what heroes could be wanted, just spare command points or gold until the next special operations is released. How to get the full weapon set? A weapon set typically consists of four weapons, which you get by researching them. You will get the first one by just playing the special operations and complete all tasks, so there are no real requirements. The second one is based on luck, because you'll get it from the daily roulette. The third one is based on luck as well, you get it from the epic boss roulette. 
Well, the fourth one can only be researched or bought with 64 gold. But if you're lucky, you don't have to spend gold at all to get the full set. Since a few special operations, you have to collect specific items you need to research the weapons. Besides the first you get for free, the others need 8, 16 and 24 pieces, so 48 pieces overall to unlock the researches. But before you spend those very rare items, wait until the special operations has ended. Why? Because you don't want to spend them, for example on the weapon you can get just by luck on the daily or epic boss roulette. In the best case, you get the one weapon from the daily roulette and if you're very lucky, the one from the epic boss. The first one you get just by completing the special operation task, so you just need to research the fourth weapon with those 24 specific items. And if you have spared them, the 60 foot gold weapon is now free for you. So let's make it short. First, wait with accepting Ellie's gifts and collecting on the maps until you get the task to do so. No, just wait with nearly everything until the task pops out. This way you don't have to waste unstable ISO 8 and get the hero in no time. Second, be prepared. Spare 300 to 400 CPs or 30 gold to be able to fight the epic boss or finish the last task. Third, make sure to get the most points out of each and every fight. Use many items, don't die. Consider team up bonuses and heal your team up until the fight ends. Fourth, wait with researching weapons until you are told to do so in one of the tasks or the special operation ends. That way you don't research a weapon you might get for free. You don't have to rush, because you can buy the needed items and research the weapons even when the special operation time has run out. Now, good luck getting your special operation heroes. If you have any other tips and tricks for getting the hero or the weapon set, please feel free to post them in the comments. And if you have any other questions, just uh, ask them in our Facebook group, facebook.com MA Mercenaries. That was uh, helpful advice from Click Skills at a Mancho Mercenaries.